scary situation for this employee. She was tied up by her hands and feet and then left in the store's kitchen. She was able to free herself and call 911, but the two suspects did get away with cash, and now police are hoping surveillance video will lead to an arrest. Concord police are searching for two men who tied up a Dunkin' Donuts employee on Fisherville Road and then robbed the store. We've heard the 911 calls and, and she sounded very upset and, and obviously traumatized by this event. Police say the robbery took place at around 3.30 Friday morning. The employee had gone out for a break. That's when she was approached by two men. The suspects forced her into the kitchen and tied up her arms and legs. At that point, the subjects moved into another area of the business. We believe they forced their way into a secure office. And then we believe once inside that office, they, they obtained a quantity of cash. And then shortly thereafter, they fled the store. Police are working with surveillance video to help identify the two men who they say are white and in their 20s. One of the suspects is described as being heavy set and wearing a light colored sweatshirt, dark pants, and a light colored cloth covering his face. The second suspect is described as being thin and wearing a dark colored sweatshirt, light colored pants, and what appeared to be a red bandana covering his face. The subjects were both seen, last seen fleeing on foot. It's not certain whether they got into a car at some point and drove off, it's a possibility, or they just made their way to wherever they came from on foot. Police are looking for anyone who may have been walking or driving on Fisherville Road early Friday morning for any information. Someone going into work early or a newspaper person, if they saw anybody on foot anywhere in the vicinity of that, of that business, to please call the police because it may be, it may be significant. Police are working with surrounding businesses to secure their surveillance video as well. If police do recover any other video, they will be releasing it to the public. And again, if anyone has any information, contact Concord Police. Reporting live, Kristen Carosa, WMUR News 9.